Mr. Lemillier, would you like to um, explain to the internet viewers what it is we're hoping to accomplish here? Well, we are going to try to use Super Mario Brothers as a vehicle to teach our kids uh, to have to have and show gratitude to um, to everyone, their parents, their friends. Um, hopefully that will translate into uh, Thanksgiving, which is coming up in a couple weeks. And ultimately, the main goal we want them to have is, is to show thankfulness to God for all the blessings He's given to them. And Super Mario Brothers will hopefully again, as I said earlier, will be the the conduit with which we will be able to communicate that. So um, explain why you're playing Super Mario on a three and a half inch screen. Well, we are playing it on the 3 inch screen because we are trying to capture some video that we will be able to use on a green screen later on this next week. And we will have several characters that we'll be playing in our series. We'll have Mario and Luigi and Princess Peach and Toad and uh, a couple of bad guys. And we need this video footage so that way we can know as far as our actors are concerned, what movements to make, whether it's to jump or to run or to to fly. That way we can get the most realistic picture for the kids' entertainment. No, I feel you, dog. I feel you. So I keep dying. And that's not the way to accomplish what we're, what we've uh, set out to do. I also feel you on that. But I'm confident, though, that I'm going to be able to pull together here. And this is going. This one here is going to be a victorious, victorious attempt. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it pretty, pretty heavily right now. I don't know if we can really see this. I wish we could, because it's pretty, pretty much on the up and up at this point. Yeah, so we're on. Um, we've got the Wii hooked into the, the camera here. This really was such a great video game. I'm not, I'm not a huge video game person, but I do remember playing this in, in my youth. Not that I'm terribly old now, but uh, yeah, it's been quite some time for myself, but um, I'm thoroughly enjoying it. Although the graphics are very one-dimensional, um, two-dimensional. Two-dimensional is what I meant. Thank you. I'm, um, as you can see, I'm, I'm uh, mispronouncing and. and uh, I'm not quite using the right term terminology because I'm so intently focused on finishing the game as I just did. Well, the question is, do you think you're ready to do it for real now? I'm ready. After I beat this one next level, so that way we can go to the castle, which is our next our next level that we have to. We have user Rob telling us this can hurt your eyes. Yes, it can. Um, fortunately. Scott Lemillier is in peak physical condition. His mental acuity is sharp, and um, his wits are keen. It's true. It's true. Sounds like another victory. That's what it sounds like. What's that Trek's Mindstorm? Yeah, I have no idea what I'm that sure is. I'm not sure I know what you're talking I'm about. <coughs> um, Don't be confused here. No, the, there's a user commenting on um, on your gameplay. And uh, apparently that brings up memories of that tracks mind storm, whatever that is. Don't be confused here. Sorry. I'm intentionally trying to to die. So that way I will be um, in the right frame of mind to play the next level. Ah, uh, video so game know. console. Just so you know. Alright, I'm ready to go. I'm ready to... Um, Alright, so... We're here in the uh, 
large room here. Alright, so we're going to press record on the DVD recorder. Actually, let me give a test run on this level.